So when I first started painting, I was using just landscape images and just like beach settings. And it just was really beautiful to me. And, and I started incorporating architectural spaces and different elements to try to like keep kind of that like open, beautiful setting of a landscape, but trying to like introduce these elements that really don't have anything to do with it. I feel like the viewer might be the figure in my work, sort of. And I like when people give me feedback, like it's a space they recognize or there's something about it that seems familiar to them. Because we all have like relationships with space and like the way the, li the light hits the building might be something that reminds you of like a house in your childhood or there's different things that people kind of file away in their memory and I think you can kind of harken back to those with images that seem special but they're just kind of these quick snapshots. When I'm gathering my source material, I use my cell phone to take images and it's a really quick process and I don't think about it really as like setting up a frame for a painting at all. It's just kind of like seeing a lighting setting that's really cool and just like snapping a quick picture or like a disco ball in a bar or it could be a cement truck when I'm like sitting in traffic and I'll just put them all in a file folder on my computer and kind of pick and choose what I want in each uh, composition. And I actually, I got into painting because I, I did a lot of dance when I was growing up, which is also important in my practice now. But when I was a younger, I, I had this really bad knee injury, so I wasn't able to dance anymore. Um, I was just like, had a knee brace on for a long time. And I have an older sister and she's like going off to college and, you know, going into science and math and all this stuff. And I was like, oh, I don't know, like, what am I going to do when I grow up? And my mom was like, well, you can focus on art if you want. And when I realized that that was like an option, I was like, whoa, you're right. Okay, cool. And, and it's okay to like get a job. I was like landscaping after school and I was like, this is perfect. <laughs> um, and, it, and like painting in my studio, but you just got to like show up in your studio and make whatever it is that's kind of next. So if that means you're going to like draw still life pictures of jars, then like that's what you got to do. Because it'll inform like the next thing and like, yeah, it's all kind of stepping stones, but like whatever you want to make at the time is kind of like what you have to make. Even if it's like, I don't know why I want to do it. It's just good to be like, this is what I'm doing. 